Trenches fans, it's time for another quick opinion. This one from the always informative MathCore Index and their MathCast podcast. I'm happy to deliver to you today this new EP from Virginia Metallic Hardcore MathCore crew Black Matter Device, which I would recommend for fans of The Dillinger Escape Plan, Frontierer, and Vane. had this continued onslaught in the past two years or so of these really incredible metallic hardcore albums and it seems like we're not quite done with that yet there's definitely going to be a point that comes where the bubble bursts and we get sick of it but for now i am more than happy to get more and more albums like hostile architecture which is available right now via bandcamp This was a band that already impressed me greatly with their previous album, Modern Frenetics, also on Bandcamp. Highly recommend checking that one out as well. These guys are very talented, very proficient musicians, and very strong songwriters across the board. And it seems appropriate that we're covering this in a quick opinion piece because this album does go by very quickly. At just about 13 minutes long in seven tracks, there's no filler here. No weak tracks, not a single dull moment. I really can't think of anything I would change about it. Black Matter Device deliver on many different fronts. You've got tracks like the ripping opener, Hurricane Pornography, that sounds like it would be right at home on a Frontier album with its highly electronic sounding guitar tone and clear, strong use of the effects pedals. got more just sort of straightforward in your face metallic riffs a la vein the song hell is other people actually sounds like it could be a straight up b-side from calculating infinity era dillinger escape plan And I also really appreciate that these guys vary up the vocals quite a bit. You've got your kind of standard hardcore, mathcore, bark, more growly, metallic vocals. And then also there are several moments like on the Great Pyramid Scheme of Giza where they break out into this weird kind of post-hardcore, wobbly, avant-garde delivery that you'd find in like the number 12 Looks Like You or Daughters. All in all, this is a very intense listen. Less is definitely more when it comes to this EP. It's like these seven fingers are coiled into a tight fist that is ready to make a crater in your skull. Favorite tracks, Hurricane Pornography, Hell is Other People, and Energy Efficient Gay Emissions, which is under a minute and a complete fiery grinder. I gave these guys a 10 for enjoyability. Like I said, start to finish, not a single wasted moment here. 10 for musicianship, top-notch performances, amazing guitars, dizzying drums, and I gave them an 8 for innovation too because their sound is a little bit out there. It's got some individuality to it, nothing incredibly original, nothing I haven't heard in some places before, but they put enough of their own stamp on it that it's worthy of an above average score. So all this rounding out to a very strong 9.3, which is an A-. So if you're a fan of intense, unrelenting, technical hardcore music, you owe it to yourself to throw down the measly $5 for the download. And also, if you look at the details under the CD version, they promise that it does not contain spaghetti. Buy it, enjoy it, spread it like a virus. (laughs) 